Tom, go ahead and tell me about the pipe you got right there. Well, this, uh, the condom's choice, uh, like Pete, I like kind of a Bing's favorite. So uh, uh, we make uh, uh, Mersham pipes in Turkey. So I took a, a Dunhill, uh, old Dunhill 197 of this configuration and our pipe makers in Turkey uh, copied that and put it in a wonderful uh, Mersham form. And that was uh, Cotton's favorite uh, number one, uh, limited edition of 50 pieces. And it came out uh, very nice. And so you designed that pipe, kind of? Well, actually, Dunhill designed it, but it was my favorite shape of the Dunhill line. It, it kind of uh, is similar to what we call a Bing's favorite style. Uh, a billiard shape, uh, but uh, slim profile, long stem. And I've always felt very comfortable with this style of pipe. And uh, our uh, pipe makers in Turkey did a wonderful job. And have we... Did we sell out of that pipe? Do we still have that? We, we uh, sold out of the uh, Bing's favorite. Uh, I also uh, really love the Dublin shape. Again, uh, I'm kind of a traditional English uh, style guy. And uh, we still have a few of the limited edition uh, Cotton's Choice uh, second series in the classic uh, Dublin, both in the smooth and the uh, resicated style. And, well, let me, let me ask you this. Um, how did Dunhill really become such a prestigious name in, in the in the pipe world. I mean, am I, am I wrong in that? But in like the 70s, that Dunhills were typically, you know, twice as much than than most other pipes or? Well, they're not necessarily twice as much. They just, uh, from the t uh, tur uh, turn of the century, they went, uh, and I don't know exactly the carryover from uh, harness making to uh, uh, briar pipes, although with yeah. the advent of the uh, the engine, they could see that there was probably a limited future for making harnesses. So maybe one of the uh, Dunhill uh, uh, family enjoyed pipes and said, let's get in the pipe. But they have always been uh, uh, certainly one of the leading uh, names in uh, pipe making. Uh, the quality of their briar, uh, the workmanship of their pipes uh, was just always uh, very outstanding. And that was, that was a very prestigious brand even here in America. Was, was there any, I mean, was there any American brands? that were kind of up there or? No, not to the extent, uh, because of that era, it was the great uh, English pipe makers, uh, uh, the Dunhills, uh, the Sheratons, the Barlings, uh, Kamoy, uh, those were the fine uh, 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 pipe makers of that era. And so that's what everyone tried to get here as well. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Well, thanks, Tom. You're welcome. Tom, what's your favorite pipe? My favorite pipe is a great old uh, 